before the blizzard arrived in North Jersey, an electric atmosphere at St. Joe Montvale. A great wrestling rivalry takes center stage on Friday night. St. Joe's host Bergen Catholic. It's our Ocean First Bank Wrestling Match of the Week. We get started at heavyweight, where Jimmy Mullen sets the early tone for the Green Knights. Mullen facing Dom Brogna, two outstanding football players. Mullen gets on the board right away with his two-point takedown. Jimmy Mullen is the number two heavyweight in the country. After beating Brogna 7-2 in the Bergen County semis, this time around, it's a 14-6 major for Mullen. St. Joe Montvale jumps out to a 4-0 lead. At 106, a rematch of the Bergen County final. Down 4-2, Joe's Vincent Pano scores the two-point takedown just before the buzzer sounds at the end of the second. Pano and BC's Brian Melamud are tied 4-4, heading to the third. Melamud up 5-4 late in the match. Pano working the left leg. He scores the two-point takedown in the closing seconds, and the Knights pit erupts. What a huge win. Vincent Pano avenging a loss to Melamud in that Bergen County final. 6-4 Pano. St. Joe's wins the first four matches to jump out to a 13-0 lead. Huge moment at 138. Bergen Catholic sophomore August Hibbler filling in for an injured Joe Kangro, facing three-time state medalist Alex Almeida. And Hibbler sends shockwaves through the gym. He's got Almeida on the ropes in the first period, on his back and earning back points. Hibbler stuns everyone with a 5-0 lead. Almeida battled back to get within 6-4, but Hibbler would not be denied. He closes out the match with another two-point takedown. August Hibbler scores a 9-4 upset. That's the third straight win for the Crusaders, and he has every right to be fired up. Bergen Catholic trailing 13-10. We move to 144, where Bergen Catholic takes the lead. Chris Bacchioni scoring the pinfall at 2-13 of the first. From 13-0 down, Bergen Catholic now has a 16-13 lead. At 150, we're in overtime. Bergen's Eric Brody and Joe's Frank DeBella deadlocked at one. It's Brody working the right leg, looking for sudden victory. But it's DeBella who emerges from the scramble with a two and a big win for the Green Knights. With five matches to go, we're deadlocked at 16. It did not take long at all for Bergen Catholic to get the lead right back. Nicholas Fea gets the pinfall in just 31 seconds at 157. Fea, with a dominating performance, gives Bergen Catholic the 22-16 lead. Trailing by nine, St. Joe's gets back-to-back -back wins at 175 and 190. Michael Delegata with a 6-3 decision over A.J. Friccioni to set the stage for the final match drama. Bergen Catholic leads St. Joe Montvale 25-23. That means the winner of 215 will decide this duel. Aiden Schlett for the Green Knights, squaring off with Remy Broncato. Broncato, a Lehigh commit, was able to control this high-stakes match. He scores the two-point takedown in the first and maintained a lead into the third. Trailing 3-1, Schlett looking to draw even, but it's Broncato not resting on his laurels, sealing the match with one more two-point takedown. Remy Brancato was clutch. The 5-1 win gives Bergen Catholic a tremendous rivalry win on the road. 28-23 is your final. The atmosphere was special in Montvale, and the wrestling was outstanding. Both teams won seven bouts, but it's the Crusaders ending up on top in the end. It felt crazy. When I walked in here, I could feel the energy of all the fans, and especially when I got him on his back, I could feel my team, I could feel the students in here. I knew they wanted it, and I wanted it too. Awesome, I love the environment. Coming from Sam, Sam versus Blair, it's a huge environment. This was just as much, we worked hard, got it done. That's what we do at Bergen Catholic. I said, you know, this is why I came to Bergen. And my coach, uh, Donnie Spataro, said this is why you came to this school, to wrestle in this. You know, I'm from a small little town. You know, wrestling's big there, but it ain't as big as it is here, so you know, be able to, just be able to do this in front of crazy fans who love watching wrestling. It's, it's the best. I can, I'm at a loss for words. It's awesome. In Montvale, I'm Rich Crampanis for JerseySportsZone.com.